Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to check the polarity on the speaker or positive and negative. So if you're working in a vehicle, the wires aren't always the same, it's not standardized color coding. So in this case we have a Ford speaker with grey and white, and we need to find out which one's positive and negative when we hook up our aftermarket speaker. It's really easy. So the way to check is we're just going to hook this up to a power source. Um, you can do this with uh, an inverter over here like we have, or a uh, car battery, even a 9 volt will probably work for you just fine. So we have white and gray on the speaker. So to find out which one's positive, you're gonna hook up your positive to one side and your negative to the other. So if you can just get a little bit closer to the speaker. Now, if I hook up negative to gray on this side and then positive to white on this side, we'll see which direction the speaker goes out. So you see the speaker's going out. That's the correct way. You always want your speaker to fire out. If I were to reverse it, you're going to watch the speaker fire in. That's the incorrect way. So you always want to make sure your speaker fires outwards. And that's how you check if your uh, wires are positive and negative. If you get one side correct and you get the other side wrong, you're going to be out of phase and you're going to have a dead spot in, of base in the vehicle. So make sure you check every single speaker and double check everything. And one more thing I want to mention before I go, doing it this way isn't exactly good for the speaker. A nine volt's probably a lot safer to do. The reason we can do it off this speaker is because we don't care about it anymore because we're not gonna use it anymore. And it's a lot easier to see it because you're giving it a good 12 volt signal so it's really gonna push the speaker out. But don't do this on your new speaker.